Hello, good evening. Hello, Aleida, are you there? Hi, Karina. Hi, hi, hi. Hello, hello, Karina. I know you are busy. <laughs> Yes, a little. Yeah, watching the <laughs> the present <laughs> speech, right? Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's. Uh, um, I am very, I am very like. Uh, uh, how can I say that? Like, you know, eager to know what what he's going to say tonight. <laughs> so it's <laughs> like you, <laughs> Aleka. Are you there or you're watching the? <laughs> Facebook Live. <laughs> You're there. Yes. Yeah, okay, very nice. Cecilia too, right? So I know many people are not joining us tonight, I think, because they are, you know, and, and I know it's important, right? It's important to know what's going on, okay? Because I know that a lot of people are not you know, paying attention to the quarantine. So that's why it's it's important for the president to be strict, right? That's nice. Karina, how are you with the platform? Tell me. Uh, everything, is, uh, everything is fine? Yeah. Okay. That's very nice. And you, Aleida, what about you? <laughs> Aleida, come on. <laughs> one one earphone, one earphone in your cell phone and the other earphone is in the in the computer, right? <laughs> I know, I know. Okay. Did you do the exercises, Aleida? Yes, right? Yes. Okay, very nice. What about you, Ceci? Have you had problems with the platform? Did you do the exercises? Okay, good. Any, any, you know, any problem or any question? Okay, let me know. Okay, that's nice. Well, uh, guys, hey, Edgar is here. Hi, Edgar. Good evening. Edgar, Edgar, hello. Well, you teacher? Ah, you're watching the president, huh? Yes. <laughs> Aleida, Karina, Ceci, Edgar, too. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I understand. I understand. Okay. Okay. <laughs> but it's it's very difficult for me because it's my job. So it's my responsibility, okay, to be here. I want to see the president, believe me. I want to, to know what's going on. So you let me know, guys. That's good. <laughs> well, uh, we are going to start, okay, today. Okay, we're going to start with this um, practice. You know, yesterday we were talking about, uh, you know, health problems, right? We were talking about having um, health problems and how to give recommendations using three phrases that we practiced yesterday. It's a good idea, it's sometimes helpful, okay, it's important too, and we, we practice using two, okay? We're going to start with the first part, and I have some pictures here, uh, and I will ask Ceci, okay, Cecilia? I will ask you to give me the names of the, the health problems that the pictures are representing, okay? So, okay. Ceci, you do the first line, and then, my friend Karina, you do the second line, okay? Number one, Ceci. Okay, uh, first, uh, um, I got a cough. A cough, very good. Continue. The second one, I don't know, it's like allergy. Okay, yeah, it could be allergy. Okay, in this case, nausea. Okay, uh huh, nausea. Okay, what about number three? Maybe I got a headache. Okay, no, no, number three is not headache. The, the, this one is headache. This is 
when when you're about to fall down, right? I feel. El mareo, ¿verdad? Ajá, ajá, mareo. Pero, I, I feel. Do you remember? Okay, I will help you. I feel dizzy. Ah, oh, ajá. Okay. I have. Okay. I feel dizzy. Ajá. Number four. What about number four? Uh, I got a sore throat. Okay, perfect. I got a, a sore throat. Very good. Continue watching the president. <laughs> now it's Karina's turn. Okay, Karina. Second line. Okay, tell me, Karina, the name of the health problems, please. I yes. got a cold. Excellent. Number two. I got a stomach ache. Okay. Repeat, please. Stomach ache. Stomach ache. Uh-huh. Very good. Number three. I got a headache. He headache. Mm -hmm. Headache. Headache. Very good. Okay. Very good. What about number four? Number four. Number four. Do you remember? This is earache. Okay. Uh-huh. I got an earache. That's it. Okay. Very, very good. Uh, Joanna, hello. Okay, Joanna. Okay, tell me what is the name of this health problem, please. We have this. I have, I have a toothache. Uh -huh, toothache. Excellent. And the last one. Um, what is this one? The last one. Edgar, uh, can you help your mom, please? Okay. Uh, backache. 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 Excellent. Okay. Backache. Excellent. Very, very, very good. Okay. And right now, okay, I will ask you for your full concentration, please, for one minute. Okay. Because we have a listening exercise. Okay. The question for these guys is, what's the matter? This is like, ¿qué te pasa? Right? What's the matter? This is the question that you can ask a, a someone if that person, you know, looks uh, weird or maybe looks like a, if he or she is having a problem, right? Hey, what's the matter? Listen to a student. It says, calling in sick. Write down the student's name. What is wrong with them? And which day will they come back? okay to college so this is what you have to do in the listening part the student is calling okay the professor okay because he is sick okay so you have to write in your notebooks or a, in a piece of paper there in your house the name of the student okay what is the problem okay or what is wrong and the day that I, he or she will come back to college, okay? Three things right now. I'm gonna share with you the, the audio, okay? So uh, turn on the speaker so if you have your earphones there, please, so we can listen to this part. Let's check. Hello, my name is Rachel. I can't come to college today. I have a cold and a cough. I will be back on Wednesday. Thank you. Hello, my name is Rachel. I can't come to college today. I have a cold and a cough. I will be back on Wednesday. Thank you. Third time. Hello, my name is Rachel. I can't come to college today. I have a cold and a cough. I will be back on Wednesday. Thank you. Okay. Do you have the answer, guys? Yes? Do you have the answers for the, the three questions? Let's see. Okay, Karina, give me the student's name, please. Excellent. Rachel. Very good. The student's name is Rachel. Okay. What about the other one, okay? What is wrong with Rachel? What is the, 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 the problem with Rachel? Uh-huh, somebody, one volunteer? I'm sorry, Karina? She's got a cold. 
Excellent. A cold and there are no two problems. Oh. And a cough. Okay. Oh. Very good. Excellent. Okay. And which day is she coming back to school, uh, college in this case? Which day is she coming back to college? Wednesday. Wednesday. Excellent. Okay. Very, very, very good. Rachel. A uh, uh, cold and a cough, and she will come back on Wednesday. Once again. Hello, my name is Rachel. I can't come to college today. I have a cold and a cough. I will be back on Wednesday. Thank you. Okay, very, very, very good. Okay, that was a little practice, guys, that I have for you today. But before we continue with the with the other topic that I have for you, I want to share, okay, with this practice, okay? This is what we're going to do uh, today. We are going to do it, okay, together. Okay, you're going to be practicing with your partners. These guys, uh, you are going to pretend, okay, you have a problem, a health problem. I have here, a, well, different health problems. For example, I like that. Can you please help me to read this part? Okay. I get really hungry before I go to bed. Very good. Continue. I sometimes feel really stressed. Very good. Three. I need to study, but I can't concentrate. Great. Uh -huh. concentrate. concentrate. Very good. I feel sick before every exam. Very nice. Continue. I forget about how the new words I learned. Are learned. Very good. This is like having problems with your memory. Okay. And the last one? I get nervous when I speak English, English to, to foreigners. foreigners. Excellent. Uh -huh. This is extranjeros. Okay. So these are the problems. What are you going to do? You are going to imagine these situations are true for you. You are going to pretend those situations are a part of your daily life, okay? So this is what you have to do with your partners. You are going to choose, for example, Edgar and Karina. So Edgar, you start and you choose one, Edgar, and you say, uh, I feel sick before every exam. And the question, what should I do? And Karina, you have to give two recommendations. It says uh, three, but I want you to do um, two recommendations using the expressions that we practiced yesterday, okay? For example, I feel sick before every exam. Uh, what should I do? And Karina says, well, it's sometimes helpful to drink tea before the exam, okay? Or it's a good idea to okay study one day before but no hours before the exam ah, okay that's it so then karina you choose a problem and edgar gives you recommendations okay this is what you are gonna do uh, i am going to take a pictures right now okay so everybody in your whatsapp group uh, look at the look at the picture i'm going to send this is the practice that we're going to have tonight okay uh, there i go I'm, I'm 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 taking the picture and i am sending the pictures right now okay that's it let's practice please uh, we're gonna work okay with the breakout rooms tonight we are just one two three four five okay that's it i think the other guys are watching the president's speech okay there we go that's it. Accept the invitation, please. Thank you. 
I'm sometimes feel really stressed. What I should what should I do? Uh, it's a good idea to relax. Okay. I I get really hungry before I go to bed. Um, I think that it's a good idea to um, Drink water. Excuse me. I think that it's a good idea to drink water before to go to bed. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, another. I get nervous when I speak English to foreign. Foreign, Herbert. La, re, la pronunciación. Foreigners. Foreigners. Uh -huh. Foreigners. Uh -huh. These are uh, like, um, uh -huh. they are eh, los extranjeros, right? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Foreigners. Very Foreign. Before I go to the bed, what should I do? That's what I said. Mm. Herbal tea or, 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 or I don't know, maybe it. Pero eso te llena. Ah? Eso te llena, no te hace que te dé hambre, porque está hablando de hambre. Ajá, esa es la pregunta. Dice: I get really hungry, yo siento mucha hambre. Es antes de ir a la cama, antes, ¿qué puedo hacer? Para que no te dé hambre. No, me... me da mucha hambre <laughs> antes de ir a dormir. Ajá, exactly. Sí. Antes de irse a dormir. Ajá. Yes, teacher. Uh -huh. um, what should I do? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. It's a good idea. Uh, let me see. To eat. No, no. If you do exercise, you are going to be hungrier. <laughs> yes. Like I, I always. You are always hungry, right? Yes, I hit with cerdo. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, Karina. Yeah. I I know, and I I I have the pleasure to know Edgar, you know, in person, <laughs> and he always always eats uh, something, so I know that he's. 
he is really really hungry <laughs> so for him it's really difficult this this problem and it's real dos panes con pollo en toda la clase yeah it's true uh, and pizza and coffee uh, yeah. <laughs> don't forget the coffee don't forget the coffee yes. <laughs> if you have pupusas well three pupusas right edgar yes yeah, three pupusas, yes, the big ones, big ones. Ah, I remember the jalapeno. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I had a problem thinking that it was a loroco pupusa. And I ate all the, well, no, no, all, but a big piece of. <laughs> yeah, and I really got spicy tongue and mouth. Well, okay, in this case, if you get really hungry, well, it's a good idea to, uh, to read a book. <laughs> for me i think it's a good idea to read a book so you can get you know like sleepy and then don't think about <laughs> about food anymore okay <laughs> thank accept. you yeah accept it okay accept the the suggestion go ahead continue continue alguien que pida una recomendación carina Hello? Hello? Hola, hola, sí. Me di una, una, una recomendación tú, este, Joana. No sé, um, por ejemplo, no sé. Uh, I sometimes feel really stressed. What shall I do? Really stressed. Um, well, uh, it's a good idea to, to eat uh, or to get este, uh, or to bring este, de, de, este, ¿cómo se llama? Cano, cano. How do you say it? Manzanilla. It's chamomile, Edgar. Chamomile. 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 Mm -hmm. sí. Ah, sí. Sí. Very good. Yeah. Chamomile. Sí. Good idea to do you bring uh, chamomile tea. To drink chamomile tea. Mm -hmm. To do exercise. Yes. Edgar. ¿No? Entonces, ¿cuál respuesta ponemos en la primera? Um, come on, my, it will be hungry. Lo que dijo la teacher. Leer un libro antes. Ajá, uh -huh, it's a good idea to read that book. Before, ajá, okay. uh -huh, before I get, I, I go to bed, right? Yes, before I get to bed. Mm. Okay, ahora eh, Karina, una, pida una recomendación. I need to study, but I can't concentrate. What should I do? Mm. Yeah. Um, it's a good idea to 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 you uh, forget any any anything or you can concentrate. It is, it is important to. Mm -hmm. Where do you live? I live in San Salvador. Oh, okay. Okay, girl. Finish. Oh, okay. Finish. Yes. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry to interrupt you. Okay. A lady that's uh, you, you're you're asking for information, right? Yes. Asking for personal information. Ah, that's good. That's good. The practice English. That's 
Ceci, Ceci, did you start classes here, online classes here since um, eh, Principiante 1? ¿Cómo? Did you start classes eh, with Inglés Corporativo since beginners? No. no. Eh, this, is, this is my first model. Ah, really? Yes. Ah, okay, okay, mm -hmm. very nice. Well, okay, so you studied English before I can infer. Yes, yes, I, I study in the university and, mm -hmm. uh -huh, and, and others. Yeah. academic other academics academic. very good mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. I, I can i can i don't know perceive that you are very young how i i can what? perceive that you are very young because of your voice oh no but i'm 24 years <laughs> ah you see you're very young <laughs> yeah lady is 20 22 right lady 23 23 i think Oh, I thought you were 21. Um, um, I'm old. <laughs> but you're single, right, Ceci? Yes, yes. Yeah, Lady is married. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah, she's married. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you can listen to her. I'm, a, I'm alone in this world. <laughs> oh, come on. Uh. <laughs> you are the one, but you, but you don't live alone. No, I live with my mom and ah, my okay. grandmother. Mm -hmm. ah, okay, very good. Mm -hmm. So you are you are right now in your house with with your mom and, and, and what about brothers? Do you have brothers? Yes, I have a house house brother. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yes, uh -huh. but uh, I'm a, a only, only the child. only child. Mm -hmm. Only child. Uh -huh. Yeah, great. Okay, mm -hmm. very nice. Yeah. That's good. Well, I I my life. <laughs> yeah. Uh -huh. So, but nice, you are very young and you have decided to learn another language. Very good, congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, this is a good idea to, you know, yeah, sometimes yeah. now that we have the time, it's important to learn something new. Yes, and after when finish the quarantine, uh -huh. uh, the classes are in the uh, office. Uh, yes, supposedly. <laughs> I said supposedly because I don't know if we are going to come back. Uh, but we are going to have, we have English classes at um, Les Calon. Mm -hmm. so we have the, the academy and the offices there. Uh, but this project is, um, this program is focused for people who work only, okay? Uh -huh. uh, right now, these uh, online classes are for everybody. People who work and people who don't work. Uh -huh. If you want to join us in our academy, it, it is uh, you know, necessary to be working and to, to have a Seguro Social. This is the... The, the, the requirement mm -hmm. okay for this mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but as i said before as i said before we are not pretty sure if we're coming back to to give you know to have the classes in the office so i think we're mm -hmm. going to continue teaching classes online oh okay mm -hmm. yeah but that's going to mm -hmm. be for a long time so you are welcome uh, okay mm -hmm. to be here <laughs> That's great. Well, we're going to come back to the main session and we're going to check the answers together. Okay. Nice. Okay, now we're going to check the, the answers, okay, together. And I don't know what happened to the other guys. <laughs> Maybe they they left the class. I don't know. Uh, we are missing for, <laughs> we are missing Edgar, Joanna, and Karina, if I'm not mistaken. Well, I, I, ah, they are coming, okay, and joining, okay. They, 
the stuff here. Good, very nice. Now, tell me, uh, we are going to start, Aleja, okay? I want you to choose one problem, okay, and give me the solution. And then, Ceci, you choose one problem, and Aleja, you give me the solution, okay? That's it. Okay, okay Aleja, you, you pre uh, well, right now you have to do what you were doing in the, in the breaker rooms. Go ahead. Okay. Give the problem. Aleida. Aleida is oh, going to ask. Okay. Uh -huh. And Sassy, you give the recommendations. Okay. I get really hungry before I go to bed. This is real. <laughs> this is real. <laughs> uh, it really works. Uh, eat um, early. Um, or maybe um, it sometimes helpful take a shower or drink a lot of water. Okay, very good. To take a shower and to drink a lot of water. Okay, very good. <laughs> Don't forget the two. Uh -huh. Okay, now Ceci, you choose a problem and you ask Aleida, please. Now Aleida, you give two recommendations. Okay, um, I sometimes feel really stressed. Uh, what should I do? Um, it's a good idea to listen to music. Um, it's sometimes helpful to, to ride a bike. Mm -hmm. Okay, to ride a bike. Okay, very good, very good. Karina, now your opportunity. Very good, thank you, girls. Okay, Karina, you ask Edgar, please. I study, but I can't concentrate. What should I do? Um, uh, it's important to study a little more. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Uh -huh. and, and give me another one. Another one. Um, mm -hmm. uh, maybe it's a good idea to, uh, to forget. forget uh, <laughs> You're sleepy. <laughs> yes. Yeah. It's a good idea to forget. Um, all the... How, I don't know, how do you say que te roba la concentración? It's called... Mm, it's important to, oh, it, it sometimes helpful to, to forget, you know, about things. About things? Uh -huh, about things which, which can disturb your concentration. Disturb your concentration. Uh -huh, disturb uh -huh, your concentration, okay? Or your inner peace, <laughs> okay? Or mental health. Okay. For example, Facebook. <laughs> <laughs> yes. and, you know, it's it, it, it sometimes helpful, okay, to, you know, stop uh, watching all those things because it happened to me at the beginning of the quarantine. I had insomnia and because I was so, you know, pending to be like checking and checking and checking social networks. And also the bad news, you know, when you're reading only bad things, bad news, bad news, bad news, it can disturb your concentration or your mental health, believe me. It happened to me. So right now I just like watch. I have deleted some or, or not deleted, but maybe I have like hidden some pages, you know, that I use, usually follow like news or whatever. I just let the most important. Right? So, Edgar, very nice, okay? Joanna, now you ask Karina, please. Joanna, you have a problem, and Karina, you give me, please, two solutions. Hello, Joanna, are you there? Yes. Okay, yes. okay, okay, go ahead. I sometimes feel really stressed. Uh, what shall I do? Um, it's a good idea to do exercise mm -hmm. and it's important 
important. Important. Mm -hmm. Get. Uh -huh. It's important to get. Okay, Cari. Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, can you hear me? Oh, yeah, no, I, I, right now, yeah, but before I couldn't. Um, it's important mm -hmm. to drink or eat vi vitamins. Ah, okay, very good. To take, to take vitamins. Excellent. Okay, okay, okay. Very good, very good. So, this is very nice, guys. Okay, the practice that we did, uh, okay, yesterday we studied this part. For today, okay, we are going to share just these minutes, okay, half of the, the class. A vocabulary, okay, and some other models that we have been practicing. Okay, here I have, I have a bag, I have a bottle, box, can, jar, pack, stick, and tube, okay? Here I have this bag, a jar, that would be como un jarro, okay? Una jarra, bottle, una botella, box, uh, una caja, a can in this case, a can, I'm sorry, is una lata, okay? Eh, a pack, un paquete, que decimos nosotros en español, right? Stick, es una barra, okay? And this is tube, un tubo de. And here, my friends, I have eight, okay, um, eh, nouns. It says a ah, of toothpaste, of aspirin, of bandages, of shaving cream, of tissues, these are like pañuelos, okay, pero de los desechables, right? Of face cream, cough drops, and deodorant. So, what I want you to do right now is to give me, okay, I'm going to ask for uh, Aleida, the first one, okay? Uh, and Ceci, Aleida, Cari, okay, and so on, to be... Um, Read, okay, I want you to read this sentence and I want you to complete the sentence using the word that I already read for you, okay? For example, Ceci, we start with you. We start with the number one. Aleida, number two. Karina, number three. Joanna, number four. And Edgar, number five, okay? There we go. Ceci, number one, please. Um, two. Toothpaste? A tube of toothpaste. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Uh -huh. Very good. Let me, I'm sorry. Let me check if I can right here. Uh -huh. A tube. Okay, like this. Exactly. Okay, continue, please, Edgar. Okay. Uh, no, no, no. Sorry. I like that. Go ahead. Hi, Aleida. Are you there? Aleida, hello. Sorry, sorry. Okay, hi, Aleida. <laughs> no, I didn't have the microphone. Ah, I <laughs> okay, you were talking, but the, the microphone was off. Okay, that's it. Um, a box. Of a box? Mm -hmm. A box of mm -hmm. aspirin. Okay, take a look at the picture. Take a look at the picture. Ah, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. that's take a look at the picture. Okay, can you see the picture there? Okay, so according to the ah, picture. Ah, okay, okay. Huh? A bottle. A bottle. A bottle of aspirin, uh-huh, very good. Could be bottle or we can have a jar. Okay, that's it. Okay, very good. Okay, number three. Uh, Karina, bandages. Uh, bandages. I'm sorry, can you repeat? I couldn't listen to you. A box of a box of bandages. Okay, very good. Nice. Okay, continue, please, uh, Edgar. Yes. Uh, Joanna, Joanna. Yes. Uh, a can of shaving cream. Excellent. Very good. A can of shaving cream. Continue, please, Edgar. Uh, 
a, a pack of tissues. Okay, a pack. Okay, very good. A pack of tissues. Okay. Or we can say also a box, right? That's it, a pack. Okay. Number six. Uh, Ceci again. Face cream. This one. Um. Un tarro, <laughs> what we say. Uh -huh. No, a jar. Uh huh. Uh huh. Very good. A jar. jar. Very oh. good. Of face cream. Very, very good. Aleida, number seven. Uh, a bag. A bag. Okay, very good. A bag. Okay, and the other end. What about the other end? Let's see, Edgar. A stick. Uh -huh, a stick. Very oh, good. good. Okay. Yeah. Stick. Okay. A stick of the other end. Very, very, very good. That's it. This is the. This is this part. Okay, for completing the the vocabulary. Okay. That's it. Now we are going to continue. Okay, with this other a uh, part that is here well these models that we have you already know okay some some of these models because we have been practicing them we have for example can could and may okay here we have a uh, four requests okay four requests and suggestions for example this one is can or may i help you Anytime you wanna, you wanna, okay, ask for this, you say can or may. What is the difference? Can is more informal and may is more formal, okay? So, for example, if you are, you know, with friends, oh, can I talk to you, okay? Or can I help you? But if you are with your boss or maybe in a, in a meeting or whatever, you can say may because it's more formal. Then other question could be, can I have a box of cough drops? Okay, this is when you go to a drugstore, okay? And you ask for some a, a remedies there or medicine, that's it. So we have, for example, a, can, can I have a box of cough drops, okay? Then other model that you can use because it's very formal is could. Could I have something for a cough? This is another way you can ask, okay, for a medicine in a pharmacy. Could I have something for a cough? Me puede dar algo para la tos, okay? For example, okay, in Spanish, may I have a bottle of aspirin? Okay, yesterday, Edgar, no, Edgar, no. I think somebody was talking about Pepto-Bismol. So, ¿cómo dirías eso, Edgar? Me puede dar... <laughs> Un bote de Pepto Bismol in a in a in a drugstore. May I have a, a bottle of Pepto Bismol? Okay, very good, very good. Exactly. Okay, may I have? So remember, these are the models that you use for uh, requesting something. Okay, can is more informal. Could is in the middle, I can say like 50 and 50, and the one that is very formal and is may. Okay, that's it. So, the answers what about the suggestions? What do you suggest? Okay, for dry skin, or what do you have for dry skin? This is like more, uh, more direct. Okay, what do you have for dry skin? For example, if I don't know, Miri, ¿qué tiene para el dolor de cabeza? What do you have for a headache? Or what do you suggest for a headache? Okay, and the answer, okay, of the pharmacist has to be like this. You could try this lotion. Oh, you could try this aspirins. You should, using the modal should, okay? And this one, why don't you try this new ointment? This is like, ¿y por qué no intenta esto? Okay, 
for example, in your case, uh, for example, um, if I ask Karina and I say, uh, what do you have, or what do you suggest? Let's see, Karina, what do you suggest for a backache? Um, backache. Mm -hmm. um. ¿Por qué no se pone hielo? Pongan, dígame. We should put mm -hmm. ice. Ice, exactly. You should put some ice on your back. Uh -huh. Or you can tell me, you could try ice, teacher. Or why don't you try ice, right? You can answer with these other three options, okay? You could, you could, you could try it, you should get, or you should. Why don't you try, okay, these other three? So remember, these models are the ones that we use for requesting, okay? Requesting something. Now, I have these three exercises, okay? It's a circle the correct words, then compare and practice with a partner, okay? Once again, I'm going to send you this in your um, WhatsApp group, okay? Because I want you to choose, okay, the best model, okay, that better fits this conversation. I'm going to send you to the breakout room. This is the last practice that we're going to have right now using the uh, models for requesting. Go ahead. It's a circle, the correct word, the comparing practice with the partner. Can I help you? Can I? Wow. ¿Cuál sería la respuesta? Como podría, y como dice la teacher, que quién es como informal, sería cool, could I help you? Could I help you? Yes, mm -hmm. are, yes. are you sure? But in this, this case, uh -huh, for, the, for, sure. the, for the question, for the question, guys, okay. Will I help you? For, for uh, the questions in the, in the look, look at this part. I'm going to share with you this part. Okay, look at the screen. Para la pregunta, help you, siempre va a ser can o may, pero nunca no. could, okay? So be careful with this. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay, so what is the answer there? Um, sure. Um, in the number one, letter A. Uh, Yes. Do. Yes, do. I no. May I have uh, something for each ice? Uh, okay, I am in the letter A, Edgar. Ah, oh, letter A. Okay. Yes. Uh, uh -huh. Give me can an I answer, help please. Uh -huh. Can, can I, I help, help you? you? Uh huh. What is the answer for letter B? Um. Uh, yes. Mm -hmm. uh, I may I have something for each ice. Each ice. Each ice. Excellent. Okay. Uh -huh. Very good. Very good. Go ahead. Continue practice. Yes, I may I have. Mm. What well, number two? Number two. What do you suggest for my muscles? 
sore, for my sore muscles. 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 Mm-hmm. Muscles. Um, Two head. Two head. Two. Two head. Uh huh. So head. So, una de las respuestas. Why don't you so head this? Su suggest. Suggest. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This ointment is excellent. What do you uh -huh, what do you suggest for sore muscles? For sore muscles. Uh -huh, sore muscles. This is like dolor de musculos, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why don't you suggest uh, suggest suggest suggest, <laughs> uh, suggest uh, this ointment is excellent. Mm -hmm. Very good. Continue. Thanks. Okay. Uh, no, you letter are uh -huh. letter A. And letter B. Can I help you? Yes. May I have something for each A? Sure. You could try. You could try a world of eye drops. And number two, what do you suggest for sore muscle? Why do you why don't you try this ointment? It's excellent. Okay, I'll take it. Number three, who I have a box of bandage, please. Here you are. Okay, mm -hmm. very good. That's the last one. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, nice. Questions with vocabulary? Sore mm -hmm. muscles. Mm -hmm. Repeat. Muscles. Muscles. Oh, Sore muscle. muscles. Muscle. Dolor de musculos. Uh -huh. muscles. Sore muscles. The pronunciation, the pronunciation for muscle is muscles. 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 Okay. Mm -hmm. muscles. Very, very good. Okay, we're going to come back to the main session to check the answers together. Thank you okay. for your participation. Okay, guys. Okay. <laughs> Once again, the other guys are, are late, okay, to join us. Well, we are going to, I'm going to share, okay, with you the, the, the slide and you read the conversation, but with the correct, okay, um, with the correct model, okay? There we go. We start, okay, we are going to start, Aleida, okay, we start with you, number one, okay, uh, who was your partner, Aleida, Ceci, right? Yes. Okay, very good, Aleida and Ceci, go ahead. Can I help you? Mm -hmm. Yes, may I have something for each eye? Sure, you could try a bottle of eye drips. Okay, very good. Sure, you could try a bottle of eye drops, okay? Very, very good. Number two. So in number one, we have can. Number two, we have a may. And the number three, in this case, in the conversation one, we have a you could. You could try. Very good. Number two, please, uh, we do it with Joanna and Karina, okay, that's it. Hello, okay, Joanna. So. Mm -hmm. Are your what? partners here? No, right. Mm, I don't know. I can I cannot see Edgar. Are you here, Edgar? No. No, right. <laughs> Maybe they le they left. Okay, well, okay, Joanna and 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 Aleida again. Okay, number two. Okay, um, what do you suggest 
for short for short muscles 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 don't you try this element it's excellent okay i'll i'll take it i'll take it excellent very good very good and the number three please ceci okay Ceci, Ceci and one volunteer, Aleida or Joanna, okay? No problem. Okay. Yeah. Could I have a box of bandage, please? Here you are. And what do you, what do you suggest for insomnia? Mm -hmm. You should try this herbal tea. It's very relaxing. Okay, thanks. Excellent. Okay, very, very good. Aha, uh -huh, that's it. Okay, so we have, as you know, okay, we have this, uh, this models. Hey, Edgar is here and Karina. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> they came back. We have these expressions and vocabulary, okay, to practice this part, right? This is a practically section number two. It's very easy. It's not that difficult. The only thing you have to know is that you have to memorize the expressions to give recommendations. It's important too. It's a good idea too. It's a bad idea too. It's a sometimes helpful too, okay? And using the infinitives. We also learned today, okay, to use different vocabulary, okay? For example, jar, package, okay, a bag, ointment okay the pronunciation for musculo remember muscle muscle sore muscles okay that's it no muscles no muscles okay so muscles this is the pronunciation for this so my friends start doing section number two if you did all the exercises for number two uh, section two please don't pay attention to me but if you haven't done the exercises Please, I invite you to do uh, the exercises. Don't be like the typical Salvadorian person to delay things, okay? Like, ay, 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 la voy a terminar el otro mes, el otro semana. No, do it, okay? Because remember, this is the requirement to enroll to the next uh, month, okay? For your online classes. That's it. If you have any questions or in comments, you can ask or comment. Uh, okay, what you have in mind. Questions, guys? Comments? Aleida? Edgar? Joanna? Ceci? Kari? No. Everything no. is fine? Yes. Sure. Excellent. Okay, very good. Do the exercises, okay? If you have any questions, let me know and I will be very, okay, happy to assist you. Uh, well, Aleida asked for some kind of a recommendation today, but then she said, no teacher, don't worry, I already did all the exercises. So that's nice, okay? You try. Lo bueno es que intenten primero, y si ya se sienten que no saben, pues me avisan, okay? Good night, my friends. Okay, ahí veo una, las noticias que se puso más difícil esto, así que don't go out. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, stay home. Okay, good night, everybody. Take care. Bye,